Harold Reynolds working the phones as our uh, booker here on Hot Stove. <laughs> Able to get Tino Martinez to call in. Yeah, Tino, you on with us, T? I'm here, Harold. You know how Harold is. Harold gets people to call in quickly. Yeah, absolutely. You, Look, we, we know you're up against it, and we, we know that uh, you only have a few minutes, so we really appreciate you calling in. But uh, we're talking about, obviously, your, your former teammates getting uh, numbers retired and also Platts and Monument Park. Take us back to your day last June. What was that like? Well, obviously, uh, for me, it was a huge honor uh, to play all those years to the Yankees and to win World Series and just be a part of all that was, you know, every player's dream. But then uh, to have the opportunity to, to get a plaque in Monument Park and, and have my name out there with all those great players that have played uh, in the history of the, of the Yankees organization, uh, it's just a huge honor. Tino, does it trip you out to think about all the trips we used to take with a visiting club? You walk out there to see the monuments, and you're going to be out there. Your plaque is out there. Yeah, you know, it, it is, it's kind of still to this day surreal that it's, it's actually out there. Um, even as a visiting player, like you said, Harold, we'd go out there and check it out. But when I played for the Yankees, a lot of times during batting practice when we're shagging balls, you know, we'll, we'll just step out there before the fans are in, in, in the stadium and, and just look at all the monuments and, and just think about the history of, uh, of, of the New York Yankees. And uh, to actually have my plaque out there, when I see it out there, it's still like, uh, I still think it's crazy. Now, what do you think about uh, the, all, everybody's going in now? We got the whole team. No, you got Louis. Louis uh, Soho waiting for his. But no, well, you're getting some guys going in. Andy's going in now. Uh, what do you think about the new guys? Yeah, Jordan Bernie Hore. Well, these guys, I mean, these guys are getting. Their, I, don't, I don't have my number retired. These guys are getting their Yankees uh, number retired, which is a, a different category. But they are so well deserving of it. I mean, uh, you know, you got Jorge, Bernie, uh, Andy Pettit, um, with, with those guys playing. 16, 18 years uh, with one organization, you know, except for Andy going away for a couple of years to Houston. Um, you'll never see that happen again in Yankee history. And for those guys to win, you know, five World Series, you know, Bernie won four, uh, you know, back-to-back -back titles, uh, what they've done as individual players and how they carried themselves on and off the field is, uh, is amazing what they've done. And, and it's, it's a, it's a well-deserved honor for, for all those guys. You know, Tino, when you look back at that time, uh, did you guys realize how great and special that group was at that time? No. I mean, you know, going through it, we knew we had a, we good, we had a good team, and um, we were committed to winning every day. And, you know, once we won that first uh, world championship, uh, then we won the second one. Then we just thought, you know, if we worked hard, we can do this every year. And uh, finally, when we lost in 2001 to the Diamondbacks in Game 7, uh, that's when it started to sink in a couple years later when the team started, you know, being dismantled. And uh, looking back on it now, thinking about what we did as a team, you know, uh, winning three out of four at one point, uh, four out of five World Series uh, uh, was totally incredible. And, and you may never see it happen again in our lifetime. Hey, last question, T, and I know you got appointments, you got things to go do. Uh, what do you think Mr. Steinbrenner would be saying right now? You, you knew him quite well. <laughs> well, I, I think he would, you know, th those guys uh, uh, that are going there. Oh, you mean now the team now? No, with uh, you guys, the group oh, of everybody being retired and all that. Yeah, I, I think he would he would he would uh, have done that, uh, done the same exact thing. You know, he was so loyal to the guys that, that played for him, to the guys that won for him, and 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 the guys who, like I said, carried themselves, uh, you know, represented the Yankees off the field as well. Uh, I think he would be thrilled that this is happening just these, these days now, and these guys having their numbers retired. But I would still think that he'd be a little more disappointed in not having a championship in the last few years. Tino, Harold Loja, thanks for calling in. We appreciate yeah, it. I do, I yeah, do. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Cheese. Right, you guys.